Hello and uh, today I'm going to show you how to install the zipline mod which is a really good mod um, adds ropes and other stuff if you want to know more in depth about what this mod does and what it's like uh, you can look at my previous video it's, I haven't uploaded it yet but it's probably called um, mod showcase on zipline mod or something uh, watch that and I'll show you all the stuff that is in this really good mod I'll probably keep using it I uh, quite like it Anyway, uh, to get on with the video, uh, first what you're going to want to go to is add download the description, I'll tag as WinRAR. Uh, if you already have WinRAR or 7-Zip, WinZip, any of those um, programs, you won't need to do this step. But if you don't have any of those, then come to this page, uh, which I'll tag in the description as WinRAR, and um, download this one for 32-bit systems. And this one for a 64 bit system. If you don't want know which one you're on, look on the internet on how to find out. Anyway, I've already got this, and most of you will probably already have it. So you don't need to do this step. And next step, what we're wanting to do is go to the second link I'll put in the description. I'll tag it as Mod Loader. Take you to this page. Uh, some of you already have Mod Loader. If you don't, follow this step, obviously. Um, so, uh, right. Right, scroll down uh, till you get to Mod Loader 1.0.0. I assume you're all on 1.0.0. If you're not, then I have no idea why. Download either of these. Doesn't matter which. Um, they both basically do the same thing. And do Show in Folder and just drag it to your desktop. And yes, I am on Windows 7 now. And I much prefer it to Vista because Vista, quite frankly, is a piece of shit. So, <laughs> um, anyway. So once you've got Mod Loader and WinRAR, if you didn't already have it, um, you want to come to this page. I'll tag it as Zipline Mod in the description. Uh, you want to scroll down version three for one point zero point zero, which I assume you're all on once again. Uh, click on the link and wait for this. It's only five seconds. It doesn't take long. Uh, there's usually an advert in here for some reason. There's not. Skip ad um, and wait for this to download. So click download, and it's pretty quick, as you can see, and it's a WinRAR zip. So we can now close our browser and drag the zip line to the desktop once again. So now you want to go to your start menu here, um, to your little search bar thing, which if you're on uh, XP and not Vista 7, uh, then it's like one of the options here is called browse or run or something and you can search it there but if you're on anything else then percentage app data percentage I'll move my mouse away so you can see that percentage app data percentage and then just hit enter um, enter not enter uh, go to your dot minecraft folder this is a fresh install of minecraft I'm using because my other one already has mods on it and things so then we go to your bin folder open that now this will be called minecraft.jar for most of you, and in there it will say a jar file. But for me, it's set to a WinRAR file, or whatever. But if it's not set to a WinRAR file for you, or a 7-zip file, or whatever, then right-click it, um, open with, and then choose WinRAR instead of Java. Uh, choose WinRAR Archiver or whatever. So open this, and you can just X that if you want. Open this, and first thing you're going to do, meta line inf. Now, that folder is a big no-no for any mods. Well, most mods, anyway. You just want to delete that instantly. It will, don't worry, it doesn't screw up your Minecraft. Just delete that. Yeah. You sure you want to? Yep. Do that. Right, it's gone. Okay, now we go to our desktop here. Got Mod Loader. Not Zipline. Leave that for later. Go to Mod Loader. Um, and mine's... And then go to Open With when we're at Archiver. And just kind of go like that. Now you want to click and drag all these files and just drag them into your minecraft.jar Just click OK And now you're done with that You don't need mod loader anymore, you can delete that off your desktop if you want Now we got mod loader So you get zipline Open with when Ok so hey guys, um, sorry about that um, stopping recording there um, So anyway, back to the video Open with Go to your zipline mod, open with WinRAR Arch Archiver. Um, you don't need to read the readme because I'm showing you what to do, obviously. So, yeah. So, 
just select absolutely everything in here. I just want to click and drag. Click OK. And that should be you. So, if we now close that, and we go to our, wherever your Minecraft is, open it up, log in. Uh, single player, I've already made a random world. Um, so yep, yeah, I don't know if I'll be able to show you that it's in here. Does it add items to creative mode? Um, no. But I think, you know what, I'll just make one of the items just now to show you. In fact, I'm going to make Minecraft full screen for you. So, um, we're going to get a crafting table. Um, uh, what else do we need? Get some. Try and remember how to make these things. String and there's an arrow with string on it, so I think we'll do that. Uh, arrow. Oh, handlebar. That does add the items. So it, yeah, so it's installed because we've got a handlebar, obviously, which kind of looks like a bow, but a handlebar is like something to use on a zipline. So that tells us that it has installed. And if we find, um, if we look through, yeah, you can see an arrow with a rope on it and things, which is quite cool. Um, I quite like it. Let's see if we can do this. Yay, rope! And in the config file, you can change how much rope it drops. At the moment, I think it's five blocks by de well, it can't be five blocks by default because that's a lot more than five blocks. But yeah, so you can change that. By the way, this is quite a cool world, so um, if you actually want the seed for this, um, there you go. You can see the seed. Um, you can pause the video at this point if you want to write that seed down. Um, yeah, because it's quite a cool world and stuff and things. So, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment and subscribe. Hope you enjoyed the video. I know it wasn't that great because I made it, so it can't be that great. But um, <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment and subscribe. And um, see, talk to you guys later. Bye.